what we've just witnessed on the floor was a cynical decision by Senate Democrats to shove aside millions of Americans for the sake of irresponsible political games. A government shutdown was 100 percent avoidable, completely avoidable. Now it is imminent, all because Senate Democrats chose to filibuster a non-controversial funding bill that contains nothing, not a thing they do not support. Nothing they do not support. Perhaps across the aisle, some of our Democratic colleagues are feeling proud of themselves. But what has their filibuster accomplished? What has it accomplished? The answer is simple. Their very own government shutdown. The majority leader only just allowed us to vote on a continuing resolution that he knew lacked the votes long before this hour. It's not just Democrats who oppose this CR. Several Republicans did as well. All of today, Mr. President, we have endeavored to reach an agreement with President Trump and the Republicans that would have not only spared a government shutdown, but cemented an agreement on spending caps, including those for our military, the health care issues, disaster relief, and immigration issues. President Trump reached out to me today, this morning, to invite me to the White House to talk all of these issues over, and I accept it. We had a lengthy and substantive discussion. During the meeting, in exchange for strong DACA protections, I reluctantly put the border wall on the table for discussion. Even that was not enough to entice the President to finish the deal. Many Democrats don't want to go that far on the border. Many Republicans don't either. But we were willing to compromise with the President to get an agreement. In the room, it sounded like the President was open to accept it. This afternoon, in my heart, I thought we might have a deal tonight. That was how far we'd come. That's how positive our discussion felt. We had a good meeting. But what has transpired since that meeting in the Oval Office is indicative of the entire tumultuous and chaotic process Republicans have engaged in in the negotiations thus far.